The return of high school sports means the return of the Danville boys and girls swim teams who both had very successful seasons before the shutdown last year. We caught up with the Ironmen in tonight's Sports Spotlight. A very successful season cut short last year for the Danville boys and girls swim teams. The boys advanced to states while the girls repeated as district champs. But in Coach Danielle Stickland's second season at the helm, the focus now is more on getting as many meets in as possible. I think it's great for everyone. It's nice for me to have a schedule. It's nice for them to have the physical activity, the social aspect of it, the camaraderie. So our fingers are crossed that we can get as much time in as possible. It's definitely exciting. Um, just to get the opportunity to do this my senior year um, when it shut down before and I didn't get to swim. So this is just something that I love doing and it gives me something that I can just keep pushing and keep going for. It's unknown whether teams will compete virtually or in person. That'll be determined on a meet by meet basis. But regardless, safety protocols are in place to try and keep the season as intact as possible. I keep my mask on for the whole practice. All the coaches do. Um, the swimmers obviously can't when they're in the water, but they keep their mask nearby. We have lots of bleacher areas, so they set it nearby. If they need to get out and use the restroom at all, masks go on as soon as they're out of the pool. The swimmers are doing everything they can to avoid what happened last year. It's kind of disappointing, like knowing that you could compete and then just kind of being sent home because of COVID. So this year, I'm hoping that. I can actually compete this year because it's a senior year and I hope I can just do my best and improve. And these teams certainly have the talent to make it far again this season. For the girls, I know that they're really going to be competitive again this year. The guys, we lost a couple of guys, but I think we're really working hard and I think that we're going to have a really successful season again. So I think if we just keep pushing and working, I think we'll be really good. Danville's first meet tentatively set for Tuesday of next week against Lewisburg.